Hello, today is Monday, June 26, 2023. How y'all doing? I hope everyone had a great weekend. I'm back for a what I'm wearing. Today's high is 70, it's currently 68. It's mostly cloudy today and rainy. I think I'm gonna get out and run some errands. Um, I'm not gonna be out too long. I had a very busy weekend, so I just wanna chill today. I might go for a walk, we'll see. And then I'm gonna get back home and get some work done. I'm not sure I'm gonna get any sewing done. I did start working on the dress last week. I just traced a ready to wear dress. So I wanna work on that sometime this week. But I think I'm just gonna chill today for the most part. So here's what I'm wearing. This is the Kelly Shirt Dress by Closet Core Patterns in this textured yellow cotton that I got from my mother-in-law. I believe I went with a size two at the top, eight in the hips. It goes down to right above my knees, a couple inches above my knees. It has inseam side pockets, also chest patch pockets. I did a contrasting fabric on the inside collar and it has these wooden buttons that I love. It has a high-low hem, but this one I did uh, the, same, the same length for the front and back. And I'm also wearing these ready-to-wear leggings by 90 Degree and this royal blue. All right, that's my look. I'll see you tomorrow. Hello, today is Tuesday, June 27, 2023. How y'all doing? Today's high is 74. It's currently 64, and it's mostly foggy, cloudy, probably some more rain. So it's nice. I can feel a nice breeze right now. You can hear the birds chirping. I don't think I'm going to get out today. Well, I might. <laughs> we'll see. But uh, for now, I'm going to get some work done around the house. Um, I'm doing laundry now. I'm about to do some stuff on my computer. Um, and then once my husband gets off work, we'll probably go to the mall and walk. So that's my day. Here's what I'm wearing. This is a ready to wear t-shirt. And I made this frock last year using the McCall 7831 pattern and the York Pinafore at the bottom. I use size 12 for both. The bib is a little longer than I had hoped, but it's fine. And then I did, I went with ties for the straps. It has a nice patch pocket at the chest, and I have these hip patch pockets as well. It goes down to my knees. Has a nice chunky hem, and I'm wearing these ready to wear leggings by 90 degree, and I have on my Crocs today for now. That's what I'm wearing. I'll see you tomorrow. Good morning, today is Wednesday, June 28th, 2023. How y'all doing? Today's high is 81, it's currently 62, and it's foggy, partly sunny today. I'm not sure if we're gonna get rain or not. I am heading out to go run my errands. I need to go by the library to drop off a DVD. I wanna go take some pictures, and I wanna go for a walk. And then I wanna get back home and hopefully work on some sewing so that's what i plan to do here's what i'm wearing this is my new make this is the wixton dress that i hacked i went with a size zero at the top this is the first time that i actually did the facing from the actual pattern i usually just do bias tape around my neckline but i wanted this aesthetic where it looks like you know i have like a chunky neckline if that makes sense I have just the one chest patch pocket. And then here's the gathered skirt that I added. It doesn't have too many gathers due to the amount of fabric. So this is actually the full width of the fabric like wrapped around me. And I'm about 40 inches around my hips, the widest part of my hips. I think this fabric was maybe 55 inches wide. I actually only have one seam, a back seam. Uh, because I didn't want to cut it in half and then kind of reduce the width of it even more by adding a seam allowance on both sides. So I just have one seam in the back. I also went with patch pockets at the hips instead of inseam patch pockets for the reason of not wanting to cut it in half. And also it's more work doing inseam side pockets. And I went with the pleats at the bottom like my Rooney clothing slip dress. So I have two full pleats at the bottom 
it goes down to my ankles and I love it I love how it turned out I finally have my perfect white linen dress I was thinking about making one just like this with my new double gauze that I got a couple weeks ago I'm not sure so because I don't know if it's going to like drape like this so we'll see but I absolutely love it I'm gonna put on my tennis shoes so I can go for a walk and I'm also going to wear my denim jacket since it's in the 60s right now. So that's my look. I'll see you tomorrow. Hello, today is Thursday, June 29th, 2023. How y'all doing? Today's high is 83. It's currently 66 and it's mostly cloudy today. Possible thunderstorms, possible rain. Today, I think I'm just going to hang out here for now. I may have to go pick up my stepson from school. Other than that, I think I'm just going to get some sewing done. I might have to still go to the grocery store. I'm not sure. Actually, no, we're, we're eating out tonight. <laughs> I wanted to go for a walk, but I'm not sure if I will or not. I guess once I hear back from my husband, I'll decide if I'm going to go for a walk or whatever. So anyways, here's what I'm wearing. This is the Kelly shirt dress by Closet Core Patterns. I made it in this blue and white mini stripe seersucker fabric that I got. I'm not sure where I got this fabric from. It's been so long. But anyways, I think I made it in a size 4 at the top, 8 in the hips. It goes down to my knees and I made this with a straight hem. This pattern actually has a curved hem. I wanted to go with the straight hem on this one. This one also has patch pockets at the hips and also at the chest. This one also has the hidden button placket. This is one of my favorite patterns. I love this pattern. And then this fabric is just perfect for summer. I'm also wearing these ready to wear leggings by 90 degree and I have on my Crocs. That's my look, I'll see you tomorrow. Hello, today is Friday, June 30th, 2023. How y'all doing? Today's high is 88, it's currently 82, and it's probably sunny today. I am heading out to go run some errands. I wanna to go to the dollar store, I might go to the library, and then I wanna get back and have a bit of a project going on, as you can see. I'm trying to do something with my scraps. So I have stuff all over the place right now, and I want to figure some things out today or hopefully today or tomorrow so we'll see so here's what I'm wearing I'm super excited <laughs> this is I actually just made this last night I just copied a ready-to-wear dress it's not a pattern I just copied or traced around a ready-to-wear dress I've been wanting to do this for years and I just got around to doing it. I've had this ready to wear dress for years and I love this style of dress. I actually have a pattern that's similar to this like trapeze style of dress and I made that pattern once. So I've had this fabric for years. I bought a ton of it when I did buy it. I got this fabric from Discount Fabric Outlet. I've actually made several dresses out of this fabric and I still have a ton of this fabric left. Where is it? So I still have a good amount left of this fabric. That's how much I got. I've also made some hair twos with this fabric. So I might make another one of these with this fabric because I love this dress so much and this fabric as well. So this is in a blue and white stripe. I used the sleeves from a different pattern. It was from a new look pattern that I have. This is the new look 6449 pattern. And I used the sleeves from the A version, which is the knit dress. This one also has, it has two versions of a knit dress. Like it has a sleeveless version. Ooh, I am going, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to make a sleeveless version. So that's how it looks. The ready to wear dress, I think I just got it from like a TJ Maxx or Marshalls. It goes down to right above my knees. And look at that pattern matching. Perfect. And I'm wearing these ready to wear leggings by 90 degree. One thing I did notice is that it just seems kind of bubbly around here. After I made it, I measured this one and my ready to wear one. 
and they're the same but I think this fabric is a little more flowier it might be a little thinner as well so I'll just maybe I might just take an inch off of the the seam or the fold if that makes sense so that's what I'm wearing I hope you guys have a great weekend thanks for watching bye